We have played few games as memorable as Brothers A Tale of Two Sons, and could not be more excited for the remake coming to Xbox, PlayStation, and PC on February 28th. This story-driven game has you follow the story of two brothers who go on a journey to rescue their father. You will work together to solve puzzles and overcome all of the obstacles they encounter along the way. While this game was originally released as a solo game, it received co-op support on the Nintendo Switch and will be receiving the same treatment with the new release along with an extensive upgrade to the graphics. If you're looking for a daring journey that is sure to touch your heart, then don't miss this one. There are tons of brand new video games that release every single year, but today we don't care about those, we are looking specifically into the couch co-op games we can look forward to in 2024. Let's get to it. Mario vs. Donkey Kong is another game adding co-op gameplay in a remake this year. This game honestly looks like a ton of fun. It's a puzzle-based Mario game where Mario and Toad will have to do some platforming and puzzle solving to rescue the mini Mario toys stolen by Donkey Kong. You will have to jump on buttons to change the stage layouts and keep an eye out for anything that might help you complete the level. You can enjoy this one on February 16th on the Nintendo Switch. Cozy games are all the rage these days, and when the game has it in its title, you know it's gonna be good. Cozy Knots is a survival game that looks similar to Minecraft or Don't Starve. You and your friend can work together to create your new colony. You'll need to gather and transport resources, explore secret dungeons, uncover mysteries of ancient civilizations, and craft items, food, and structures. In short, all of the makings of a fantastic survival game, and you can play this one on Steam on March 28th. Go Fight Fantastic is a hack and slash game that is very colorful and vibrant, and it looks like a ton of fun. You play as a crew of smugglers, and you have to work together to defeat all of the enemies as per usual. There are four different characters for you to choose from and customize and upgrade to be completely your own. You can play with up to three players, and this one is planned to release in Q1 of 2024, so definitely look into it if it's your style of game. Unfortunately, from this point, we move to games with unspecified release dates. All of the info we have about these is that they will be coming in 2024, but that doesn't make us any less excited to play them. Towerborn looks like a very promising beauty Beat em up hack and slash style of game. You play as an ace born to protect the people of the Belfry. You can play with up to three friends as you venture out into the world to defeat monsters and return to the Belfry to complete quests and reforge weapons. There are a bunch of different weapons to find and mix and match to make your character and style completely your own. This game is intended to have a continuing storyline as new seasons of the game release and will be available on Xbox and PC. I have never never played Streets of Rogue, but I knew that I was interested in Streets of Rogue 2 as soon as I saw the trailer. This game has some of everything. It is an open world sandbox adventure fully based on character choice. Your goal is to topple the corrupt president while doing anything else your heart desires. You can build a farm and create a business, hire mercenaries, hack computers, and even hold people hostage whatever you want. With a ton of different classes to choose from and endless possibilities, we cannot wait to pick this one up on the console of our choice. One of the things that I love most about video games is when they allow me to do things that are unrealistic in real life. Surmount, for example, is a game all about climbing a mountain. While it may have once been possible, I've put on a little bit too much weight for rock climbing to be as easy as this physics-based game makes it look. Surmount is all about the journey up the mountain and the eccentric characters you meet along the way. Each has their own reasons for climbing, just like you. So enjoy upgrading and customizing your character to give you the best chance of reaching the top. And don't forget to bring along a friend when the game is released on PC. Sailing the Open Seas and Cat Quest 3 is one of the things I'm looking forward to most this year. This cat-themed action RPG features an open world to explore, seamless sea-to-land travel and combat, and classic quests to complete along the way. This whole game is based around exploring the Caribbean and creating your own story as you hunt for treasure. It will be available everywhere sometime this year. Can you have a good co-op games list without a retro-styled beat-em-up? 
Uh, well, yeah, you can, but still, Toxic Crusaders looks fantastic. If you enjoyed TMNT Shredder's Revenge, then you should probably be interested in this game. You could play with up to four players with seven characters to choose from, each with their own fighting style. This game continues the story that was left abandoned when season two of the show did not happen. It has fully voice acted motion comic cutscenes, and it will be available anywhere you play games. Go Go Town looks like Animal Crossing, but with actual two player co-op. In this charming cozy game, you can take on the position of Mayor in a dying tourist town, and you have to revive it to bring more tourists to the location. Everything is up to you in this game. You get to hire new artisans, cooks and shopkeepers, build bigger houses, restore old buildings, and do everything you can to make the best tourist location on the map. If you like games like Stardew Valley or Animal Crossing, then this is definitely one to put on your list, not to mention it will be available everywhere. Now, there are just a couple of games that actually haven't been confirmed for 2024, so maybe we're just being hopeful, but let's talk about them. Wizard of Legend 2 is a fantastic looking roguelike with no specific release date as of yet. This one will support up to four players and will have you casting more spells than you can keep track of to defeat tons of enemies and big bosses. Currently it is only listed for release on Steam, but as the first game was available everywhere, we're crossing our fingers on that one. Rotwood is one of the games I am most excited to play. This is a fantastic looking beat em up hack and slash dungeon crawler game from the creators of Don't Starve. As huge Don't Starve fans, we cannot wait to play this game and get bashing enemies, crafting weapons and armor, and fighting through dense forests. Again, this one has only been announced for Steam right now, but like with the other, Don't Starve was released on consoles. So let's cross our fingers on this one too. Lastly, we have just a couple of games that are already out on PC, but should be coming to consoles this year. We have talked about Played Up several times and honestly cannot wait for this roguelike cooking game to make its way to consoles on February 15th. This is kind of like Overcooked meets a roguelike. You will have to cook and serve food while also upgrading your restaurant with new appliances to hopefully achieve your goals and go on to create another franchise. You can play with up to four players at once locally or online. Body Bite Land Overclocked is a 3D platformer somewhat reminiscent of Astro's Playroom. While it was not our favorite co-op game, we did have fun playing it. The entire game is themed around the inside of a computer and fixing viruses and bugs that are happening. There are tons of fun mechanics from a cool boat ride that you get to go along to electric slides you get to go down and play the music as you go. If you're a fan of 3D platformers, then this is definitely one to put on your list. While we are incredibly excited to play all of these games, it's really important to remember that there were a ton of great games released last year, and you can see our top 10 in this video right here. I cannot wait to see you over there. We love you guys. Y'all are awesome. Click right here.